The next one, we're going to get in, into uh, the uh, how the, the different variety of the eight psychic channels, the eight psychic channels. The first one we're going to do, we're going to do the, uh, the spinal cord microcosmic. The spinal cord microcosmic. The spinal cord microcosmic, you can start from anywhere. Always start from a pearl. When you condense to a pearl, and you can work on it. As we said, the pearl is your essence. So you get to the pearl, come down to the perineum, anus, and pull up, pull up and contract around the coccyx. And feel that you draw the energy right into the, the sacrum. And the energy is going to walk going to work in like this, going up on the, the front, the front part of the spine. There is a tube, okay? So the energy coming up and walk near to the front part of the, of the spine. That means it's inside. So I draw it this way. Inside, front part of the spine, the inside, and running up right to the front, on the, in the inside, and all the way up to the to the head and spiral and rope and, and rope around the brain in the inside and coming up to the outside and coming down on the back, the inside, the tube but to the back. Okay? Running down to the spine on the back here all the way the inside, all the way down. You can do a few rope like this. Actually it's called the inside of the spinal, uh, the microcosmic of the inside. And this one become a very, very important in the later part of the practice. And when you finish the inside spinal cord, we're going to come outside the spinal cord. The outside of the spinal cord, you're coming out. You come, it, when they, later on, you come in, in, in like a spiral. Like a spiral. So you come out, outside, and you work. On the, come down to the tip of the coccyx and you start this spiral on the outside of facing inside. So actually working like this. Your energy spiral around this area. On the outside, all the way up outside of the brain, all the way down outside of the brain, and all the way down on the spine, all the way down to the sacrum. Like this in a few rows. This one is protecting the spine. Okay. So in this way, you rub the energy around the outside of the spine and the inside of the spine. And the whole spine protected. Because the whole spine is the, the spine is so important. It's everything there. All the nerve, all the all the why inside there. Okay? So this is um, this one you can do anytime, anywhere. Often time I sit down, do nothing, I just use my mind to spiral in the, in the, in the spine, around the spine, and you protect it. That is the center, the center of the, all the white hole thing inside there. When the spine, any part of the spine is, is obstructs, you get a problem in the whole pain. Whole back pain, whole leg pain, the hand pain, you cannot walk, you cannot move anything. Now it's a butterfly. Everything that you do now, you are cutting into the field. You're cutting into a electromagnetic field, and the law of the cutting through the electromagnetic field, you increasing and denser the field. That's all. That's how uh, olden time they discover. And this one is a middle body cut. It start right above the nipple, the point that you have learned. Right above the nipple. And you started to spiral in a small circle, back to the point, bigger circle, back to the point, you see? Small circle, bigger, bigger like this. So on the both sides, start right above the nipple, point, and, cir and circle, spiral outward, this way, this way, this way. And it cut right in the middle of the body. The energy cut in the, in the middle plane. Here the body cut in the middle. 
So the energy field cutting this way, and bigger and bigger until it cover the whole head and the leg, and like a butterfly wing on the, on the both side. Okay, and uh, you have the um, you have the trussing china cutting this field, and you have the belt china cutting this field. This is another angle of uh, belt channels. The belt channel cut this way, and now the belt channel cut this way. Okay. And this is a very good practice. You can do any time also. This, all these things you can do any time. Now, um, this is uh, a two, actually two figure eight, and is, we add up another figure eight. It's right on the mount. Okay. Because it's the sense of this part, apparently, we're going to teach in the greatest country, but we just put in, you know, in the later on, it's in a, this is part of the very small part of the ceiling of five senses. Okay. So, the way is connecting the senses together. All the senses connect into and uh, connect interconnections. So, the way you do, you start on the mid eyebrow. Okay. You running is not matter on which side. You start the mid eyebrow. You can run down to the left eye, bottom of the left eye, circle the left ear, coming down and coming up in the ear, coming up to the left eye on the eyebrow, and circle down to the right eye, coming up to the top corner of the right ear, circle down on the right ear and up and come up to the right eyebrow and circle down come up to mid eyebrow come down to the nose on the left side and circle on the mouth come up to the right mouth come down to the bottom on the chin come up to the left corner of the mouth come up to the top corner of the mouth and the nose and come up to the right nose and come up to the right to the mid eyebrow again so is Actually, it's a three figure eight. And the joy point is right in the middle of the mid eyebrow. And the senses is connecting right in the middle. Right in the middle here. And then all the senses draw into one. And the connection point is the four, is the three figure eight. Okay? It's the three figure eight. The next pattern is the uh, we call a drill or clear out the whole head in actually drilling this way it's happened only in the head okay you start by drill right in the middle the two f two point on the forehead you drill right through it like a long drill it's a six inches or eight inches to drill from the front here drill all the way to the back this one we call empty, emptying the brain. There are many ways to empty the brain, okay? Like if you become a monk, you don't own anything. You drill from the forehead all the way to the back, forehead all the way back, the face, whole face, all the way to the back. And it happened on the top of the head. From the head, drill all the way. So you should start doing the, you already doing that one already. You're in the trusting channels, you know? The trusting channel, you two hold, shh, shh, down. And the front three, back three and uh, you already have all the all the nine point all the one two three you all you have all the nine point over there already and you do right to it and you get it next one is very powerful in us in the psychic protections and uh, you can do it before you go to sleep we call the spinal cord cutting it cutting right into the spinal cord and the point coming up on the throat center, come out of the throat center, okay? The throat center is here. The, you get the energy, come to the, per, uh, to the throat, project the pearl out. So you shoot above your head and, re and, and circle back, cut right in the first cervical. Cut it right in the, between the first cervical. Um, when you're beginning doing that, if you have a lot of resistance, you can feel like something, something like really stick right into between your, 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 your bone. You can actually feel like something stick right into you between the bone. So cut right into between the first cervical, coming out, 
into the second cervical, third, fourth, fifth, sixth, seven, and come up to the thoracic, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, to twelve, come down to the lumbar, to the sacrum, and back, when you finish the last one, back to the throat again. Okay, when you finish right back to the throat. Now we come up to the, it's still in the mid eyebrow again. This one, cutting into a, again this plane. But the other one is on both sides, and this, the other one on both, the butterfly is on both sides, cutting this way. But this one is cutting this way. Okay, from the mid eyebrow, coming out, and cutting, cutting right in the middle, like this. It's just like you get a, a wire stick from here, go out this way. And coming, you take a wire, cut from here, stick in this way, go out this way. But from the neck on the side of the on the right neck on the side of the right neck, come up to the left neck. All these things I tell you, spirit don't like. <laughs> and the evil spirit, they don't like it at all. Because it's a too much penetrate into their field. And uh, they cannot take it. And that way that why if you do it, they don't want to get in. <laughs> and uh, if you have it, that it, that means you practice dairy, they just oh my god, I don't want to bother this guy. <laughs> I don't know what to say, you know. Sometimes I hear so many people that practice, you know. They go to a system, right away they start, you choo, go out, and come back. And come back and you talk, oh my God, I go to somewhere, oh beautiful, oh nice, oh light of heaven, okay. I, I tell you, I say, I don't want to go. <laughs> Until I get myself ready in this way. Because the place is never changed, it's always there. So this one you're cutting on the angle all the way down, on the uh, on the right side of the rib to the left side of the rib like this all the way down all the way down passing every center cutting right into the center into the organs into the leg into the all the way to the leg and finally back again to the mid eyebrow again <coughs> now we come up to a we call a aura aura Quoting. We already did that in the fusion when you draw the big bubble, you coat on the skin. And uh, when you coat on the skin, it's very close to the body. Okay? So the aura don't expand out too much. And, um, and that is important. So every time you start a pearl, that means you form a fusion. And you, when you get feel a con concentration of energy or pearl, you bring down the perineum. And bring it down to the right leg, to the right leg, and come up to the big toes. Now you started to jump the energy in a different angle. Jump the energy. The energy can jump from the big toes, the mid eyebrow, the elbow, the tip of the finger, the T, uh, the C7, the coccyx. All the sharp point of the body, the energy can jump. Okay, all the sharp point. In this case, the big toes can jump the energy. The big toe on the right leg can jump it to the left big toes. Because the big toe, if you look at the tip, the big toe is very sharp. Here's how the energy can be jumped. And uh, so from the Right big toes jump up to the left big toes. And it like a whole sheet, like a whole sheet. So you started to coat like you get a spray. Spray, coat the toes. One is toe, big toe, second, third, fourth toes. Coat the whole thing. And come up on the whole side. Apparently coating the whole side. It gets spray. And come out on the left side side of the pink uh, of the small toes all the way in the whole left side all the way up to the tight to the left hip to the left ribs to the arm pitch come out this one they come out on the under the inside of the hand coat the whole cheek and come up to the finger come up on the up top come up to the shoulder Come up to the ear, the whole cheek coating this way, coming up to the top of the head, to the left ear, come up to the left side of the head, to the top of the head, come down to the right ear, it coat the whole cheek, 
to the right shoulder, down, it down. Down this way, come up to the to the front. Down to the back on the back side of the hand, and coat every finger. The finger is very important. You need to coat them. Okay, and coming up to the right hand side on the inside, all the way out to the shoulder, and down on your right arm pitch, right rib case, right hip on the side, to the right thigh on the outside, and outside of the leg, all the way down to the finger, on, to the toes on your right leg, and caught the energy, caught the finger, and all the way down to the, to the inside of the leg, to the inside ankle, up the inside, to, all the way up to the perineum, and coming down to the inside of your left leg, all the way caught down to the left ankle, the inside of the left ankle, and come to the big toes. Okay? If you want to finish, you jump back to the right toes. If you want to go on, you go on the last one. Okay? The last one we call a put a big X. That means I don't want any people to enter me. So you put a big X in the front and a big X on the back. And that is um, it's very important, you know. <laughs> and, uh, and, uh, now we start from the left toes. Okay? Left big toes. So from the left big toe, the left big toe, we come out on the out, we come out to the outside and lay a spray coating on the outside and coming up to the to the left hip. To the left hip. Okay? From the left hip, you draw make a, a energy a cross to the right shoulder on the inside. And you coat the energy down on the inside, coat the finger, come up to the outside. And you go again across the head, the, the head, from the right side across the head, all the way down to the, all the way down to the outside of the, um, the left hand. And coat the finger coming into the inside of your hand to the arm pitch and come up to the left shoulder. From the left shoulder cutting right, from the left shoulder cutting right into the right hip. Left shoulder cut to the right hip, so you get an X right in the front. The cross section is right on the heart. The crossing right on the heart, okay? So it's right this way, okay? A cross section like this. The, 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 the X is right on the heart. So from here you come up from the left shoulder, left chest, crossing right into the right hip, and you're going out down, going out down to the uh, right leg on the outside and coming down, coming up on the right leg on the inside, and come up to the back. We put the X on the front, and now we're going to put the X on the back. Apparently, you don't care, uh, left or right, you can start, but here, a pattern. You come down to the right leg and coming back to the inside of the right leg. Come up to the right hip. You, you make a cross from the right hip, casting into the left shoulder. Okay? Cutting right into the left shoulder. And from the left shoulder, running down the, in the inside of the hand, in the finger, coming on the outside of the hand, on the left hand side, and come up on the left ear to the, to the head, coming down to the right ear, to the outside of the hand, cover the finger, coming down to the arm pitch, coming down to the arm pitch and to the right shoulder and the right chest, on the, uh, sorry, on the back on the right shoulder on the back, okay? So from the right shoulder, make, cut across to the left hip. From the right shoulder, cut across to, to the left hip. Getting down on the back, on the side here, and running into the, the left leg, outside of the left leg, 
to the toes, to the, all those small toes, big toes, come up to the inside, inside of the left leg, come up to the perineum, going down on the inside of the right leg, and end on the big toes. Okay, and the right end on the big toe. Apparently, you just have to remember an X on the front and an X on the back. Okay, it's a two X. And this way, this one is always do together with the coating. Always do together with the coating of your body. And the coating of the body is just like you spray a plastic. Wear the color you want. You can change your color every day. You have a rainbow color to change. Now, and when you finish, you just cut an X in the front and the X on the back. The X on the back is the T5 and T6. Right there. You have a tape or a video. You listen to a few times and you get it and you just sit down and practice it. And you want one part, you just listen to it again. Okay? Smile down. <laughs>